guys welcome back so today I wanted to play with one of the new palettes that I picked up in my latest beauty what I bought video <laughs> I'm not calling it a haul y'all know I'm not calling it a haul it was just a little baby a little baby stuff just some stuffs okay so this is one of the palettes that I showed you guys in my last little stuffs video okay now this is the latest ace beauty palette okay i don't know if it's ace beaut ace beauty ace beauty but i'm gonna call it ace beauty because it has one of those little things on the e you know getting a little fancy so this is their latest palette this is the flare palette and as you can see it's in some very bright orange packaging and the lighting is like really causing a glare because it has this beautiful gold embossment on here and the writing is in gold and with that being on top of the orange it can be a little bit difficult to see but as you can see the design is very very pretty now on the back of the actual palette there's nothing but the box looks just like the palette and on the back of the box is where you get all of your information as far as your ingredients 12 month shelf life, cruelty free, all that good stuff. You guys know the rundown. So that's where you can find all your information. So if you throw your box away, you're not going to have your ingredients and all that stuff because the actual palette is blank, okay? So I'm going to keep this video real short and sweet because this is a first impression. Of course, you know I created this eye look with this palette. And I must say, y'all know I get a little bold, get a little wild whenever I'm dealing with one of these colorful palettes. This is what this palette looks like, okay? So what really attracted me to this palette, I think, is the orange and the purple and the blue and like this super duper bright lime green down here, which after I put it on my eyes, as you can see, it looks yellow to me. I don't know. Maybe it's just the camera and when I go back and edit this video, I'll be like, oh, it does look green. But right now it looks yellow. So that was something that I was really drawn to, but not really that excited that it's looking yellow to me. But maybe it looks lime green to y'all. But that color is gorgeous. Maybe if I put down a super duper white base, it'll pop lime green. Because you guys know I use my MAC Paint Pop in the color soft ochre so it's not stark white but anyway yeah this palette really called to me these colors just instantly was like okay i love it this beautiful shimmer shade here is what i have on my lids of course and i love it i love it you guys it is gorgeous this pat this palette is very very pigmented and what I want to do now is just go ahead, swatch the whole palette for you guys, and then we can just jump right into this eye look because first impressions, I like it. I want to play around with it some more. As you can see, I did go ahead and use a lot of the colors from this palette for this eye look because I really just wanted to just throw some color on my eyes and see what happened. And this is what I came up with today. <laughs> so let's go ahead, do these swatches, and then we'll jump into this eye look. palette is gorgeous the range of colors in here is absolutely amazing some colors swatched a little better than others I would definitely say that this blue the darker blue is a lot more pigmented than this lighter blue here but they're both very very gorgeous blues I don't know this palette kind of gives me a year-round vibe it really makes me feel like I can use it year-round because the gorgeous bright colors kind of make me think of spring and summer but it also has a little bit of like a grungy kind of fall feel to it as well I don't know you guys let me know but it really does give me a all year round vibe and I don't even know did I say the name of this palette this is the flare palette I don't think I said the name of it and as you can see there is a mirror in here but yeah it definitely has some flair to this palette okay 
So now that you guys have basically got my first impression on this palette, I like it. I actually can't wait to use it some more to do maybe like an orange and purple type look or maybe just an all blue and green look. I kind of blended a lot of colors here. So it kind of looks like a rainbow look, but not really. <laughs> but I do want to try out some more monochromatic looks using this palette with just like the orange and the blues, you know, separately. So I like it. I think it's gorgeous. I don't remember exactly how much I paid for this. So I will definitely list somewhere on the in the video the basic information on this palette for you guys and if you want to purchase it i'll put a link in the description box below but that's all that i have to say about my first impression if you'd like to see how i created this look as usual stay tuned because it's coming up next hurt.